What up, what up? Welcome back to the channel. This is Wealth Frequency with Justin Jack Bear. So what people are wondering is how does NVIDIA, Coinbase, and ICP really come together in terms of being the trifecta for the future of the internet, global finance, and general AI? Well, NVIDIA is pumping out millions of general AI GPUs with inference and memory on board to act as nodes to become the global internet infrastructure not reliant on centralized cloud servers. And Elon Musk is buying them. Um, you can think of a Starlink as a sort of general internet computer technology that I'm not even quite sure what the backend system is for, for Starlink, but I think the point is that the Internet Computer Protocol is a protocol for the Internet 2.0 that's safe and secure, which is what Elon Musk has been preaching for the last few years and in the current events, um, current shows that he's attended and uh, with the NVIDIA CEO launching these new GPUs. And if you think about where Internet Computer Protocol is not classified as a digital asset or security, it means that it's not restricted and limited to only finance regulations and rules, which is where most of the crypto market is going to get is going to get slammed. The developers and founders for digital assets and securities in the US will have to be accountable for the cybercrime the theft, the identity theft, and everything that goes on under their watch and development, if it can ever be proven in court. So those are some red flags because all the money used in those digital asset and crypto tokens, your money is going to get liquidated to go into legal battles that will last until the money runs out so you're going to be fueling all these other blockchains and crypto coins and meme coins or the exchanges will be accountable for it like coinbase which is why coinbase is working with the sec to build the regulations and the rails for digital finance and crypto assets so if you look at that where bitcoin has now been legally defined as a digital asset storage of value. Internet Computer Protocol was proved in court and defined as a utility token, not a digital asset and security. Why this matters? Because there's no other blockchain that was allowed or proved to be a utility token other than ICP. Every other token is a digital asset and security so this positions ICP as the fundamental backbone protocol layer of the internet 2.0 which coinbase is going to leverage in its in its uh, journey for dominance as the global crypto bank and wanting to open up crypto banks coinbase banks around the world there's going to be have to be some some type of regulatory framework around it and coinbase plans to dominate so you you line up icp as a utility computation token the only one in its class by itself in the united states and europe while europe and switzerland create the rails and regulations for crypto and internet out of switzerland which will influence the European Union or European regulations on crypto, which will then come into the US um, because safety and security and reliability is the number one priority. Elon Musk just said it again. NVIDIA CEO just said it again. And the Coinbase CEO has always been talking about it. So get in the crypto space at your own risk has always been the case. 
But the point of the, the, the videos I'm making with NVIDIA coming out with GPUs to run AI inference plus Coinbase being one of the major exchanges to purchase crypto and move crypto. And then you have Internet Computer Protocol whose costs are 0 0.0001 to move Bitcoin, the cheapest anywhere in the world, plus near instant finality without custodians or middlemen with encrypted rotating keys. People, listen to this. These are the giants that are at play. And ICP is going to blow everything out of the water for general AI, computation, smart contract, digital finance, dApps, decentralized apps, DAO, decentralized governments, cheaper, faster, and tamper proof. You cannot hack a canister. I'm pitching a YouTube series to Definity Foundation. You heard it here first to see if we can get some hackers to crack in the canisters. That would be my idea. I'm trying to pitch it through social. I don't think it's ever gonna reach the top. It's something we can do independent. Maybe the networks can finance, maybe an application for grants through YouTube. If anybody has any ideas on how to do this or any influencers who've received grants from anywhere uh, through Definity or anywhere else, it would be cool to bring on, uh, there was one guy who was on the uh, the Ryan show, the uh, what's his name, Ryan show, who talks about all the tech, military, and has all the um, um, Navy SEALs on his channel. Uh, the, the Not the Drew Ryan, something Ryan show. But there was a hacker on there, and they have these devices that can basically hack into Wi Fi, steal passwords, um, just by being in the proximity with these devices. So if you think about that, where the internet is susceptible to these types of devices, can those devices break the canister code to manipulate data, information, or code inside of canisters? That's the big question. Now, we know Definity Foundation has proven already, and we're scaling, but can we set up a real-world YouTube series and try and make that happen? That's part of the film, 10 years of film industry that I've been in and creating content um, animations, digital, digital storytelling is kind of some ideas that I want to see if, if it's possible, if the money's there, if it makes sense, that would be great. That would be a great series to have um, specifically around internet computer protocol. Um, but getting off topic here to say that you have to look at where the industry is at. I've got over almost over 5,000 hours of research and development and two years staked indefinitely. And um, and so I spend most of my waking hours researching, studying, paying attention to the trends, news, what's happening, where things are going. And really, there's a lot of strategic connections happening in the world, especially after last year, Internet Computer Protocol and Definity Foundation had meetings and partnerships created with um, Hedera and, uh, you know, talking to Elon Musk's brother, um, who I think is involved with the Dogecoin, you know, research and development of tokenization. There's rumors that we've had tests already with Google and Starlink, and those are all very possible. And then we saw a pump around the time we saw the shakeup with the execs and lead developers while Coinbase is on a hiring spree for cryptographers and engineers. The timing seems too great. And then ICP was added to an ETF, um, you know, a public ETF where institutions, institutional banking and companies could move their money into the Internet Computer Protocol ecosystem now that also could have had a play on the price action at the time and it's hard to say for sure so with 44 percent of the internet computer protocol locked up and staked for a year or more that conviction there basically proves that with infinite scaling potential not on ideology scarcity 
or storage value. But because the cost and need for computation power around the world is blowing up so fast that even a first world country like British Columbia in Canada, provincial government has banned indefinitely crypto mining. So too energy intense. And that's, that's the challenges that we're seeing in the crypto space, in the general AI space, in large language model space. A new server data center is being built every two days around the world. I'm involved with some other technologies that I can't disclose here on the channel yet. But essentially, it's um, cost-efficient ways to convert, uh, convert computation into energy, uh, reducing the cost of energy, uh, tapping into green energy, sustainable energy, renewable energy, regenerative energy. Uh, this is going to be a huge, huge uh, industry coming up in the coming years. And so what are people going to do when crypto mining and crypto is banned in their city, state or country? We're going to see a lot of issues, a lot of people having lost access to their accounts, their wallets, um, the taps being turned off or the accessibility turned off in different situations. We haven't even seen uh, we haven't even seen that the, the the tip of the iceberg on, um, you know, the control over data and centralized systems. So with NVIDIA coming out with GPUs, with onboard memory, GPU, and um, the design to create digital nodes that are going to be distributed all over the world. Elon Musk is already on this. He's heavily, heavily invested in NVIDIA's new GPU because he says that they can build it better than he can. And that these are going to be nodes distributed all over the world and I think this is his expansion in the Starlink to have ground uh, ground nodes decentralized with rotating multi keys with something like ICP but there's nothing else like it in the market there's no other type of technology like ICP that runs independent nodes we're seeing basically cloud cloud brands and businesses emerging repackaged and branded as decentralized cloud but still using centralized servers and cloud infrastructure so don't be fooled because internet computer protocol is the only technology out there that runs independent nodes worldwide and we're going to get into the millions we're already at 10,000 plus nodes this is going to scale very quickly with general ai coming into the market once these gpus start getting hooked up and being used we're going to see a massive explosion uh, of the internet computer protocol ecosystem, uh, computation, cycles being used, uh, deflationary, and that's all coming down. And so you wanna be ready for that. You wanna be positioned to be ready for that. So look at the price now as a discounted, tokenized utility for the internet 2.0. And my strategy has been, I've had a couple bags purchased where I've locked them up indefinitely and then dollar cost averaging $5 a day over the next five years. And if you can wait five years, if you can afford it, maybe you can only do $4 a day, maybe you can only do $3 a day, maybe you can only do $2 a day, maybe you can only do $1 a day. So you go onto your centralized exchange, whether it's Coinbase and whatnot, sign up for an unlimited transaction, a monthly fee, and, um, and then just do a dollar a day cost average to get in. That way, when the price fluctuates up and down, you're averaging in as opposed to buying high and the market dumping 50%, and then you're losing 50% off the, off the hop. So you do it slowly every single day. It's just one strategy that I use. But I did purchase a lot of bags that I staked up into a Neuron long-term at whatever price it was at, I think around eight or $9, um, which is fine, sub 10 is great. So I'm not uh, upset about that and I'm still accumulating. So those are just little strategies that you can take away from me and how I'm leveraging my own position in the industry, but it doesn't matter what the price is really. The focus is on the technology and if adoption is the only barrier, access to information is the only barrier, um, with developers all over the world starting to use caffeine.ai, and in 2026, Web3 wallets being integrated into it, 
this is gonna be this is gonna be way bigger than anyone can feel or see right now except for the people who know if you know you know right so um, you know a Definity Foundation was all over the world last year ICP hubs they were in over 400 events worldwide last year and working with universities and students um, <clears throat> running uh, hackathons and events really going after the next generation of developers the next generation who is going to benefit from the new digital economy the next generation who is going to lead the future of internet 2.0 general ai is really exciting times guys and girls ladies and gentlemen very exciting times so um that's my video for now just wanted to share that with you because it's important that you understand that you got to somehow draw connect the dots you got to draw lines you got to you got to put it out to the universe this is like manifesting things in your own life if you write it down you talk about it you start to put together the synergies or the synchronicities that you see in your life you got to connect the dots if you can't see it then you can't manifest it but if you can see it and you can speak it your words and your thoughts become reality so that's why we put all this content out there. That's why we share information. That's why we are alive in the ecosystem. That's why we're alive in the community. I want to help the ecosystem, the community. If you have an ICP project and you want to work with me, um, go to jackbear.ai. I have some packages that put together for, um, for myself to help promote your project. Um, very reasonable prices. It will be labeled as promotional. I probably won't have any stake in any projects. But I want to help the ecosystem. I want to help the developers. I want to help the projects uh, accelerate with exposure. I've been getting a lot of great uh, audience reach in the last month that I've started this channel. It's been uh, almost four weeks, only three weeks. And uh, you guys have been blowing up my channel. So thanks for all the subs. Thanks for all the comments, likes, and shares. And if you want to have a phone call one-on-one -on -one with me, you can schedule that as well uh, by sending me an email, justinjackbear at icloud.com. And uh, yeah, look forward to chatting about it. Anything you want to talk about. There are some by donation uh, suggestions on jackbear.ai as services. If you want to chat strategy, uh, project, business, Web3 business development. Um, and you can learn about Web3 at the world's first gamified Web3 uh, academy uh, built at jackbear.ai. So I developed uh, uh, 50 courses and lessons you can go and learn about everything web3 blockchain internet 2.0 bitcoin uh, smart contracts why blockchain is important um, i'm posting all the courses and lessons through video as well so that all 50 are available uh, if you'd like to follow along on youtube as well so um, yeah open to ideas please report any uh, issues with the website love chatting to you guys super stoked 2026 is going to be absolutely mind-blowing all right, to the next video. Stay groovy.